God bless you, Dr. Kazumba Charles. Today, I just want to hang out with you on this special day and pray with you as we finished our series on uh, uh, four signs of demonic influence and how we can stop them in our lives. But I want to talk to you briefly before I pray with you how to stay free. You see, one of the greatest struggle for a lot of people is that they experience deliverance. They experience the power of God to deliver them from from certain situation but they don't stay free and the reason is uh, usually we forget to close off uh, certain doors in our lives we need to learn how to close off some doors in our lives if you don't close off some doors in your life it becomes very difficult to move forward so how I pray right now in the name of Jesus that you are going to close off certain doors that we are opened in your life you need them close but before we pray I want to tell you first how to stay free and continue in freedom. Number one, when you are delivered, you need post deliverance care. You need men and women of God or the church where you can now go to for Bible study, go to prayer groups, stay in within the church so that they can be cared for. And what happens is that you're going to grow spiritually and it gains some strength to push back the enemy when he's trying to open certain doors in your life. And then number two, stay alert. Don't let the enemy pull you back to the same thing that you used to do. For example, if you used to go to nightclubs, don't let the enemy pull you back there. Close that chapter, close that door, continue going to church and involve yourself in prayer and fasting and you will see that the enemy will definitely, definitely not have his way on your life. I want to pray right now that the Lord is going to help you to stay free because the struggle for many is that uh, they don't remain in freedom because of the enemy's influence upon their lives. But Father, in the name of Jesus, we declare your strength upon my brother and sister that is watching right now. We pray that Father, the enemy is not going to pull them to the back to the backwards of oh God. The enemy is not going to pull them into the past, Almighty God. In the name of Jesus, we pray. We come against right now any influence of demonic spirit upon that family, upon that couple, upon that marriage, in the name of Jesus. We speak freedom. We speak a release right now from every influence that is not of you, God. We declare today salvation upon that couple in the name of Jesus. We break every works and plans of the enemy against them. And we pray today for a release and a breakthrough over their lives in Jesus' name. Those who are sick right now, we release healing right now in the name of Jesus. Those who are believing you, Lord, for a breakthrough, we release that breakthrough in their hands so that they can give glory and honor unto your name. We declare today by the authority of the blood of Jesus that this is a new day, a new season for that sister that has been struggling for a long time. We declare salvation has come upon your life right now. We declare salvation has come upon your household right now. In the name of Jesus, Father, we thank you today that victory is achieved through the power of your name, O oh God, over that family that has been struggling. Today, salvation has come into their household. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. You are there. You've never given your life to the Lord. Or oh, the enemy has just attacked you to do things that you don't even like doing. I want you right now to give your life to the Lord. Because when we surrender our life to the Lord, God does special thing. Just pray with me. Say, Dear Jesus, I repent of my sins. Cleanse me and wash me. Purify my heart. Purify my soul that I may follow after you and save you in Jesus' name. Amen and amen. I believe you've been blessed by this topic that we were covering and I pray that I want to see you. Email us so that we can pray for you. 
and continue to support you as you continue in your deliverance. Email us, you can see the email on the screen, as well as uh, you can message us on WhatsApp, text your prayer, and we're gonna pray for you. Go to our YouTube channel, subscribe. We've got lots of teaching that is gonna bless you. Until then, God bless you. Keep going higher.